Hello friends. Today I will teach you how to do line art renders from 3D Studio Max with the Arnold Render. First I downloaded this mecha from cgtrader.com and I'll put it in the link below for you to download. It's free so you can follow along. Now here we are in 3D Studio Max 2023. When you import the model, it comes in very small so you have to scale it up to see it at the proper size. Next, you go to the right and you add a UVW Mapping Clear modifier to make sure no corrupted UVs are present. It will not render if they're corrupt UVs. You can skip this step if you have a model with properly set UVs. Now go to the render setup and set it to Arnold Render. Go to the Arnold Renderer tab. Set the camera samples to 6. Now scroll down and click on Filtering. Under Type, select Contour. Set the width to 4.0. Then go to the System tab and set Arnold Render View to use for this scene. And set Device to CPU as it will not work with graphics cards. Now go to the Common tab and set the size of the render, in this case 1920 by 1080. Now once done, set the screen to Active Shade Mode. Now you have to add a light, so click on Create on the right, then Lights, then Arnold Light. Under Type, select Sky Dome and place it anywhere in the scene. Now go to the Material Editor. Search for Tune Shader. Now find Map to Material. Connect the Tune Shader to Map to Material. Assign it to the Mecca by selecting all of it and then assign to Selection. Now hit Render. Already you should start seeing results. Now you can see by the lines we have to increase the amount of lines around the Mecca. Now go back to Tune Shader. Set Reduce Base Weight to 0. Now scroll down. Now set Increase Emission Weight to 1. And set the Edge Detection Angle Threshold to 50. Now render again. You should see more of the lines. If the lines are too thick, you can decrease it by going to the edge with scale and lower the number to 0 0.5.
and these results look pretty good. To save this image, go to File, type in the name and the extension. In this case, PNG to save it without the background and just to save the lines. Now let's open in Photoshop. And you can see just the lines have been saved. To improve the line work and remove some of the harsh lines, make sure the image is in 8 bits by going to Image, then Mode, then 8 bits. And then create a new white background to see the lines better. Now click on the layer with the lines. Now go to Filter, Stylize, Oil Paint to remove some of the harsh anti-aliasing and to give the lines a more organic feel. And just follow these basic settings on Oil Paint. And here we are, we're done. And if you like this tutorial, please subscribe. It really helps the channel grow and there's more content coming your way.